Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope everybody's doing good. We're back in for a bit of farming sim. I'm really, really enjoying this at the moment. I must admit, I'm purely just enjoying the uh, the ground formation side of things. So, problem I've got. So we've got horses set up now. We've, well, I haven't bought any yet, but we have got uh, a horse pen and a sheep pen, right? Which is good. So I think we're winning there. But I could really do with putting in a silage pit somewhere, and I don't know really where to put it in. So I'm thinking, because this is my farmhouse, so I was thinking of putting it in round here. I don't think that's going to work. Hey Sam, how's it going man? So can't put it in there because we haven't got the room. Oh, I'll tell you what, could we knock? Could I knock this cliff in and put it in here? So I don't really want to ruin this at all, but I have got this bit of room here, so I could bring this back to like here. Hey Greg, how's it going? Yeah, I don't want to ruin this at all, but I could knock in here and put in a silage pit in here, because the silage pits come in... Where, where, where are they? I can't remember what they're called. Hang on. Bear with me. I know they're in here somewhere. Are they under animals? I don't think they are, are they? What are they under? I can't remember. Ha! Silos. That's what they're under. So... Yeah, I was thinking about putting one of these in today, is kind of what I was thinking, so... So it would have to go in like here. Right, my audio used to sound a lot better. Uh, well, I've, I've changed mics now and I don't really want to go back to the old mic, so... Yeah, I don't know whether to knock that into that cliff or if we should just put it somewhere completely different. Uh, Mark at me, yeah. Well, I've gotten to these wireless microphones now. Uh, so these little lav mics. And again, they're not an expensive mic. Uh, but it's, so when I've got two people in the room, it's, it's better for talking. But. So why can't I put this in? So I don't really know where to put this. Right, doesn't matter. Anyway. We'll stick that in later. I'm going to go and uh, I've got some uh, harvesting to do anyway. And then we'll decide what to do. So. Uh, now I know what it is. It's, your, it's not under my chin. It's down, it's down here, buddy. It's not. Uh, it's where they're meant to be. Again, if you don't like it, just turn the stream off. 
unsubscribe and disappear. I'm not changing it, so sorry. I just have so many people complaining at the minute, I just cannot be bothered. A lot of the things I changed when I moved was more so I could stream with other people in the room. So that was all. Yes, some things have got worse, I get it, but I don't care anymore. Right, let's go harvest them, man. Right, so I've got field 21 to knock out, I think. Hey, Jack Thomas, how's it going, mate? Hope you're doing well. Right, back over here. Uh, time I'll be on till maybe one, two-ish, you know, that type of time. So I'll be off all day tomorrow, so... Uh, yeah, can be on a bit today. Evening uh, next, how's it going, man? Uh, mark at me, you weren't being, honestly. It's not an issue, buddy. I know you weren't. I know you were just making a comment, and that's absolutely fine. I I'm quite aware that it definitely sounded better before, but as I say, this is as good as I can do. I've got people wanting to come around and stream with me, so I needed it to work from that point of view, so that was all. Alright Dean, how's it going? I'm okay. <laughs> Cheeky. Yeah, I'm probably going to do a little bit of ground, uh, sorting some ground stuff out today, but I, do, I don't know where I want to put my silage pit, to be honest. So I'm not, not sure, I'm really happy with the, where the farm is at the moment. I don't want to ruin it by putting a silage pit in, but I could really do it with having a silage pit, so... Alright, Henley, how are you doing, buddy? I'm doing really good, thank you for asking. Yeah, much better. As the day's going on, I'm feeling better and better, so... Yeah, absolutely spot on, buddy. Hey Tony, how you doing buddy? When did I last have a haircut? <laughs> like two days ago. I need it again, like it's, it is actually starting to grow already. I should just start shaving it every day man.
Yeah, Jake, I'm, I'm thinking that cliff face that we've got. So I've got a... Yeah, so there's a cliff. Like, over here, right? Hey, baby shark, thanks for that. Yeah, there's a cliff here. So I'm thinking of knocking this back is what I'm thinking of doing. What do you reckon? Do you think we should knock it back? It's a shame because I kind of like, I like this path through here. But, ah, Tony, you just heard from Simlabs. Awesome, buddy. Uh, just heard from Simlabs. Ah, that's good, man. That is good. Right, so we're going to knock this back, I think. Right, so can we, how far in can I go, hang on. Right, we'll go into about there, I reckon. I'll bring this back a bit. Right, that's fine. Right, so that should give us enough room, I reckon. I think, anyway. Ah, excellent, man. Delhi's process is on its way. Cool. You must have been busy then. Right, so if I do that and then do... A bit of this, and then we can start merging some of this in. Uh, just bear with us, I'm just trying to make this not look as uh, as rough, man. Too bad. Might actually, in the end, look a bit better, actually. I'm just thinking.
I need it a bit bigger than that one. All right, hang on. It's really hard doing this with a joystick still, but I wish I could do it with a mouse. And when everyone said the update had fixed it, I was like, oh, get in, that's meant... It, it hasn't at all. <laughs> Don't listen to them. Right, so I'll need a, I'm going to need to plough this today, aren't I? I should really just plough this today and get it over and done with, to be honest. Right, I need to fix that a bit. So that needs fixing. Ah, oh, well, let me actually flatten this. Oh no, we got it. We're all right. Right, so that's flat. So I need to paint that in if I can. I might need it. We're definitely going to need to do some ploughing tonight, I tell you. Definitely. I need to try and flatten this out to be more of a hill. It's too much of like a, an edge. Alright, that's a bit better. Right, so then we're going to pop back and put in where the silos, this is it. So I think we're going to put in a smaller one, I reckon. Right, so we'll put that in there. Right, FS19 almost deleted me. <laughs> it's addictive, isn't it? It is massively addictive, man. Love a bit of plowing leg, don't you, Mark? Absolutely, mate. Once a year. Married life. Married life. Alright, so... Uh, I, I really, I think I'm actually going to need to plow this, I think. So I think... Alright, if we do... I think it's that one. Is it that one we used to put the path in? Yeah, I think it is. This is looking a bit narrow around here, man. Right, so definitely want to put grass in there. And then, to be honest with you, I think this should all just be mud. Right, so... I reckon this should be mud here. Right, so if you're driving up to it, you'd probably want to drive up to it this way 
So I think we'll just make this a bit bigger. Maybe it's a bit big that, but. Uh, that'll do. So then you can cut down. Right, so I'll need to put this into grass and then this will need to come back and connect onto here, like so. Right, and then we need to plough the rest of this. I think, should we maybe lift this bit up? I reckon, hang on. I do like to lift stuff up. Right, so, oh, Jesus Christ, that's a bit violent. <laughs> Hang on, we'll just turn that down a bit, I think. Right, so I think maybe lift some of this up a bit. How close can I lift this up? I think that's about it. Uh, that's fine. So I think I need to cut this back a bit again. Hang on. I can't have flattened this bit out. Oh, well, let me. Ah, got it. So, all right, and then can just flatten this like this. Make it look a bit more natural. Oh, I need to plough this as well, mine. Alright, make this bit look a bit more natural. And we need to go and get the plough out of the shed. Excellent. Right, where's my harvester at? Ah, need my trailer. Let's go and get the trailer out. Right, er... Uh... <laughs> oh, mate, I like that. I like that. <laughs> Bit of ash though, Sam, do you not think? Right, how, how's everyone else doing? Uh, I think I was talking to Tony, I might have missed his message. Congratulations with Emma, hope you have a nice day and... Ah, thanks mate, much appreciated. Yeah, it was very nice of you that buddy. Very, very nice of you. I haven't spoke to Emma yet because I need to speak to her to see if I can... Uh, to see if we can go out tomorrow night, but I'm pretty sure we will be able to, buddy. Bryce, uh, hello Bryce, how you doing, buddy? Alright, so we need this trailer. I'm going to do an end with that, there we go. Alright, I'm going to take this over to the harvester. I'll do a bit of harvesting and then we're going to take the plough over to that other field and knock a bit out there as well. So, hey James, how you doing, buddy? Are you saving for a trip to go and see Tazzy, Nate and Fee? Awesome, man. Right, 
Right, put, we can put the pipe away now, uh, which is zero. And do some harvesting, man. Tell her I said happy birthday. Oh, absolutely, mate. She's on the group as well, so feel free to send her a happy birthday, mate. Oh, mate, I've got a bag of sweets. I said they're, they're for like a week, man. <laughs> SC, how are you doing, mate? One thing I love about late night streams is a bit more laid back and just a bit chilled, it's great. And to be fair, whether I streamed it or not, I was going to come on and try and spend a bit of time on the farm anyway, so... Absolutely loving it, man. <laughs> Got you there, uh, Sam, buddy. Hey, Nathan, how you doing, buddy? Hope you're having a good night, mate. Thank you for that beast, man. Much appreciated. Uh, the difficulty that I'm playing on is just uh, farm manager. Uh, I think it is. So, but again, I, I've got I've got a money mod in anyway. So, sounds good, Nathan, man. Hey Nathan, uh, 6930, hope you're well buddy. John Rambo, how's it going man? Yeah, all good here mate, all good. Can't even drive to McDonald's because I don't have a car anymore and I'm too tight to pay for delivery. <laughs> Got you there, man. Right, what type of vape do you have and can you use? Uh, I have a Hugo Raider with a Falcon tank on, buddy. Just working on Meadow Grove for 19. Awesome, Nathan, man. Look forward to it, buddy. I look forward to it. Uh, SC, I, I don't know, buddy. I, as long as I fancy, mate. Pro probably for uh, uh, at least another hour, hour and a half or something, I would say. We'll see, because I'm not streaming all day tomorrow, so I kind of want to enjoy a little bit tonight. Ah, cheers, Daniel. Yeah, we've had this one a bit of a while now, like, I must admit. It's getting on a bit, this chair. But, yeah, we've got another chair coming for the other rig, which I'm, I'm looking forward to, see, see what, how comfortable it is. That's a Simlab seat, so... Right, we're going to go and wake up the John Deere and uh, get cracking. I need to stop running at these stones, man. I can't pick them up either. I 
I tried ordering stuff, uh, Simlab stuff, one out of stock. Oh, nightmare, man. <laughs> they are flat out at the moment, like, I must admit. Yeah, they're absolutely flat out at the moment. And don't forget, if you're in the UK, Demon Tweaks uh, also is a supplier of Simlab, so if you go on Demon Tweaks, you can buy some Simlab stuff on there. Ah, oh, Dean. Right, Mark, dig a little hole for the stones to fit in. I know, I was just thinking that, but the tool doesn't go that small, to be honest. Right, super glue them down. <laughs> that could be it, man. See you later, baby shark. Have a good one. Uh, where else are we? Hi, Mark. Uh, what are you up to? I am ploughing some ground so I can grass it. A uh, couple of jobs I wanted to get finished on the farm. I didn't have a silage pit, so we just added the silage pit in. Right, the new update to Forza is out. Excellent, I might give it a blast. But I did see a lot of people playing Forza again, so I might uh, take it for a run. It won't be till Friday though, buddy. No, it doesn't grow after you paint it, no. It never, it never did, to be fair. Yeah, see you later, SC buddy. Have a good one.
Yeah, as I say, like the nighttime streams are somewhere where I can chill a bit as well, you know, so I'll not be as chatty like, I'm just uh, enjoying playing the game. It's so addictive this, man. Honestly, next, much appreciated, buddy, but the vape house rush didn't really help me out, like, so. Oh, that shed pack that I got, man. Honestly, uh, it, it's just well polished. It's probably the only well polished mod out there. Hello from Greece. How are you doing, buddy? Hope you're well. Daniel, how's it going, mate? Yeah, I do a bit. Do a bit. I've got one of my tanks has got a major leak. The other mod's completely, uh, completely off. So I'm not vaping as much as I normally do, but I'll get them sorted. Right, good evening. How are you finding new screens? Are you sitting closer? Oh yeah, a lot closer. Yeah, a lot closer. It might not look it, because this doesn't look much closer, but the centre screen uh, before was sitting next to the back wall. Uh, I mean, oh, I don't know, maybe, I don't know how far it was. It, the centre screen was sitting just, just above my feet, which are way further forward. I couldn't touch them nowhere near, whereas I can touch this, that's me touching the centre screen. I don't even have a lean or anything, it's just, I can touch all the screens from here, that's how close they are, it's great, it really, really is good. Right, uh, right, so, I should really plough this section next. Hi, I'm Max, how are you doing? Oh, much appreciated, man. Much appreciated. I do appreciate the kind words. There's no need for it, like, but I do appreciate it. Right, uh, the ETS2 updates, spot on man, yeah, absolutely, absolutely, cheers Jack Kelly, much appreciated, right, so, I could probably just curve straight around here, I reckon, need to put some shape back in here, man, I've lost a lot of shape here, Cheers Ben, how you doing buddy? Uh, do a great job, why, so, ah, you do appreciate it, I really do. Henley, uh, I mean, all you can do is save up for it really buddy, I mean, if you do want the game that bad.
Right, uh, let's turn this bad boy around. Right, uh, no problem, buddy. Yeah, no problem. Right, so maybe it's just go straight down here, I think. And then we'll come back and fill that bit in. Right, I'm just trying to get some sort of border on and uh, fill in the se center and favorite simulation game it depends what mood I'm in to be honest with you and depends what I want to do no I'm never in discord unfortunately I mean Discord was never built for me, it was built for everybody else. I don't use Discord enough to warrant having one, personally. Uh, but everybody wanted it, so... It was one of the things, but it's all... It's just people, it, there's loads of members, there's just not many people ever talking, because I pop in some days just for a chat, and there's no one out... Very rarely anyone actually in. Uh, Rad, I mean, you just got to, there's not, I mean, if you're a kid, there's nothing else you can do. There's not a lot you can do. There's going to be some politics uh, in a minute, I think. We don't need politics in here, man. <laughs> Dean, <laughs> I know, pal, I know. <laughs> James, hey James, I might half that popcorn, will you, man? I tell you what, I haven't seen for a bit. Yeah, I haven't seen Mr. Twinkam, if anyone's seen him. I hope he's doing alright. <laughs> yeah, honestly. I think Luke, I mean, Luke has got a fair point at the end of the day, but 
And certainly not something I'm going to start arguing about. Right, cool. I need to go and empty the other vehicle. I'm going to leave this over here because I've still got this bit I want to plough as well. So I'm going to leave this here. See, all this needs... See, see this flat green here, right? It won't grow. It'll just stay flat like this. So what we're doing is ploughing it and then we're going to plant grass in it. That's all we're doing today. I have got a harvest and harvest in the field as well, but... shed man okay I thought you were gonna yeah I'm just to say we're just gonna grow grass yeah just grass in this one uh, basically at the moment I'm just trying to get my farmyard uh, up and running you know obviously we built all this from scratch so I'm just trying to get this finished and then, uh, and then I can enjoy actually farming a bit more. Yeah, Jim, tell your partner I said hello, mate. Luca mate, the rules are there for a reason. If you don't like it mate, just, just disappear. Whether you think it's a swear word or not, that's the rules. Move on. I kind of get that bit. It's a bit bumpy, I think. <laughs> I want to keep it bumpy, though. Oh, we got that bit, though. Hang on. Just that bit I've missed. Thank you, Luca. Much appreciated, man. I'll tell you one thing. If we go out tomorrow night, I am 100% having steak. <laughs> it's been too long. Trying to get as much of this as I can, but what I might do is go over it and then just go over it again to see which bits we miss. Uh, Rad, no, it's a, it's a standard map that I have used the new uh, ground tool on. 
and we've converted it we've put all these mountains in and yeah kind of like landscaped it as you as you would say Ah, oh, you're right there, man. Sticks, um, like, every day, man. Ribeye or sirloin? I am a bit of a rump man as well. I, I can appreciate a really good, uh, a good rump steak, man. Oh, I've never had a, I've never had a tomahawk steak, man. Jesus. No, but they're, they're always the deepest as well. I mean, what what that would cost is probably what I'll spend at dinner. <laughs> so no, definitely not, man. Too much. Uh, I don't know what you mean there, the game doesn't have force feedback, buddy. <laughs> sure you got your wellies on, Jesus Christ. Right, I didn't get any of that there. Trying to grasp as much as possible, man. It's hard where it's rough. It just it won't it won't go, man. Now oh, we got it. We got it. Lovely. I need to go and empty this harvester in a minute as well, man. But if we can get this done, I can then make it grow. Uh, which is another job done. Yeah, you're right there, man. Wrong game, Dean. Get him told, man. Get him told. So, what are you? What? What's? What's everyone else up to tomorrow? Then, seeing as I won't be on. I know Sam will just be sleeping all day. That's Sam Burnside.
Sean, I thought you were going to look at the house on Saturday, buddy. You can't be moving if you haven't even looked at the house yet. Have you already seen it? Oh, you're working. Oh, she's already started packing, Jesus Christ. Got that bit. Oh, yes, yeah, Sam, I forgot you're moving as well, man. Jesus. Bet you can't wait, pal. Bet you can't wait. Everyone's moving at the minute, man. Mad. At least it's not just me, I suppose. Am I going to get the full game or what, mate? Ah, uh, yeah, I bet that's not true, man. You just want to see the wife happy. This is a full game, mate. Right, I'm going to leave these here because... Uh, I need to do all this down here as well, but we wouldn't have time for that today, man. Right, we'll dive back over. Oh, I'll tell you what, while I'm here, I may as well do... I may as well do something with this end. This is probably the hardest part of trying to make your farm look better, is the constant ploughing, man. But it's one of the bits that if you don't do it, it won't look as good. Right, I need to do the right side as well, but we're not doing that today because we just don't have the time, man. I want to get that other field ploughed and to be honest I wouldn't mind getting it cultivated as well. So... Alright, so I need to seed this as well.
Uh, my vape's here, buddy. It's uh, it's here. Yeah. Not on it much today. It is leaking quite a bit, to be honest. Alright, this up here, man. No, it's uh, James, it's the uh, side of the glass is all cracked. I just need to put another glass in it, but I'm starting. I think I've only got two left. I've used Emma's spare glass, two of my spare glasses. So I think I've got two or one left, I think. Yeah, I think I've got one left. Right, so I need to go and empty this bad boy. Oh, that's true, Dean. You're right there, man. Right, and then we need to bring the cultivator in here as well. Charlie, what's the difference is plowing and cultivating? I mean, I don't, I don't know the specifics. Obviously, a cultivator just turns over the top. It doesn't actually turn the whole soil over. But again, I'm not the man to be talking about stuff like that. Someone like Oz Farmer or someone would be able to answer you. Uh, far better. Uh, buy a house. Oh Jesus, man, that's unreal. Oh yeah, what one ten? No bother. Round here, you'd be looking anywhere from ninety to one ten for a reasonable priced house, three bed. You know, reasonable. Uh, like housing estate. I tell you one thing though. You go up to where my mum and dad lives, you'll get a massive house for nothing. The farmhouse we had was absolutely beautiful and I loved it. It didn't even need much work on the inside doing it. It was really clean, uh, technically four bed, uh, and, and it was just absolutely spot on. Loads of land, loads of outbuildings, and it was up for 148 grand, I think. And then the other house we had, we had a big, big, Victorian house in a village called Kirkum, which you can look up on Google. Uh, it was a house opposite the pub, and it was uh, five bedrooms, including two living rooms, uh, three floors, Victorian, so it's 13 foot ceilings, where I had my first games room, funny enough, and uh, it was massive. The only downside is it had a very small back garden, but it was huge. It sold for 91 grand. 91 grand for a five bedroom house is unreal. Right, where did I leave the thing? Ah, here it is. So I found it, don't you worry. Oh, the farmhouse, you love that man. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. 
It really was. It was like a dream house. I would live there again. Just no internet. But the Victorian house that was uh, that we lived in, I, I mean, if I'd have known what that was going to sell for, I, I would have bought that, like, to be honest. Even though it didn't have a garden, it was a massive downside, like a decent garden anyway. But some house that for the money. Three bed terrace, then it cost 300 grand. Jesus Christ. Oh, I bet, I bet. Yeah, you want to hope it comes with like a free donkey or something, man. Jesus. Uh, Kelly should have had the glasses and the skirt on, man. You would have got it cheaper, I'm telling you. Right, we'll leave that there. I'm going to go and get a quick nap in the old house. So we'll, we'll take this bad boy back round. Right, I'm just going to get an, a sleep now, because the good thing is you can skip the night times now. Which I think's mint, man. Ah, it's a fair point, man. No wonder you're super skinned, Jesus. Right, so in theory, our grass should have grown now. And then we need to grab the tractor, empty the trailer, put the header away, give it a wash. Then we need to take a cultivator back out to field 21 and get that cultivated. I'm going to go and see if my grass has grown, which it should have done. Ah, it has grown. So this is the grass that we put in here. Obviously we haven't done the left hand side yet, but we have done this side. Ah, it's looking all right, isn't it? Ha! That looks way better. And it's quite hilly as well, even better. So, ah, hello? Uh, is it PG? Yeah? I thought he was going to like run in and start star jumping or something. Oh, you did your first square? Yep. Oh, that's neat as hell as well. What the hell? Ha! <laughs> Check you out. Oh, for those of you that don't know, this might look either really old fashioned and ridiculous or quite sad, but my wife has no hobbies like animals, is about her only hobby. Uh, she doesn't have any hobbies at all. So, and she's not, she likes craft stuff, but she isn't crafty, if that makes sense. You agree with that? Yeah, I'm useless. Yeah, useless is a term from her mouth. Uh, so she, my gran, <laughs> got her into crocheting, gave her an idea about, what, two days ago? Yeah. Yeah, two days ago. So Emma has been, we took her out yesterday, got some wool, got some needles and this is a first square that she's made so obviously this you can add like more to it and make blankets and all sorts so hey well done i'm keeping this though yeah yeah but i want to take photos right you take photos but i want it back well done babe thanks that does look pretty cool man nailed it so can you just make multiples of them and then like yeah then you stick them all together and then you make a blank so you're going to carry on making them then yes that's mint how happy are you though? Fun. Sorry, I can't see you because of this big stupid chair. Yeah. No? Right? Yeah. Oh, there you are. You happy? Yeah. You're knacked though, aren't you? <laughs> You're going to give up now and just go to bed. That was mentally exhausting. Right, I'll see you in a bit. Yeah, I'm going to probably be about. Eh? I'll probably be about an hour. Right, okay. If I talk here. Yeah, 
Right, everyone saying happy birthday. It's not birthday until after you've been asleep. Oh, apparently it's not your birthday until after you've been asleep. So, thanks for the birthdays, but you're wrong. <laughs> thanks, anyway. <laughs> Alright. Say it again tomorrow. Right, apparently you all have to say it again. I'm not on tomorrow, so they can't. Right, okay. Right, sorry about that guys, we're back, she's well happy. And to be honest with you, chuffed a bit for her because I, I have hobbies and have had hobbies ever since I met her. And uh, yeah, I'm super pleased for her that she's finally got something she can get her, you know, stuck into and that and enjoy. I think it's just awesome. She's loving it as well, man. She's well happy. Um, we're losing the night time again. All right, I need to go back in there. Where's the mud at? There it is. Right, so I take it. How am I running this here? I think we need like. I think I need to go like round here. Whoa, where are you going? What? What am I doing up the hill? Way. I don't know why this won't. Ah, there we go, it's alright. And it come like around here. Alright, there we go. Trying to like create some paths, man. Nightmare. Alright, so if I lose this here as well. All right, there's one path. Get rid of that. Lovely. And then we'll lose that as well. Can't, don't think I can do that bit. I left my tractor in the road, man. There we go, that's fine. Right, uh, lol, Dean. Before I see tomorrow at work, yeah, got you there. What was it? Uh, looks meant though, to be honest. Thanks, Nathan, much appreciated. Happy birthday, Emma says Ed. Greatly appreciated. Nice job, says Sean. Thanks, Sean. Sorry, I uh, completely missed. Uh, oh, bless man. She sounds dead happy. Honestly, man, she has been losing it. Uh, ah, still up, Mr. Simulate. Doing some dodgy stuff at this time of the morning, I would imagine. Whatever he's doing, it'll be dodgy. I'm going to end up giving him like a really bad name. <laughs> I should probably stop. Right, so we're going to... I think we'll knock this bit off a bit. I think we'll have this as mud. I definitely prefer the mud than the original like bit that they put in. Not keen on that, man. The mud looks far better. Also, what I really need is some street lights, man. Right, so that's looking a bit better. I may as well just lose this here. Cool, cool. Right, so I've got them mountains that need painting a bit more. But we do now have a official silage pit, man. Excellent. So one thing that I really forgot to put in when I built my farm was a silage pit and uh, we do now have one. Excellent. Sorted, right. Now what I need to do is, I need to really smooth that out like. <laughs> right, so we'll leave the rest of the grass in for now and we're gonna hop back over and grab the cultivator and the tractor and trailer so 
We've been trying to knock a field out as well. Good year shoes any good? I mean, I use Sparkle shoes and I have to say they are pretty cool, man. Uh, Felsbrun, mate. This is my Felsbrun map that I am using the new update tool on and I have converted and tweaked and pulled it and prodded it and rubbed bits out and added bits in and yeah. This is field 19 at Felsbrum, this. Oh, I've completely changed it. Uh, <laughs> it's meant, I mean, don't get me wrong, it's not as good as what a modder would do, but uh, I love it. <laughs> I think it looks absolutely mint, man. Oh, I'm still so pleased for her though that she's actually, I was concerned she was going to give up because <laughs> she was finding it rather hard. Uh, so. I'm uh, chuffed a bit she's kind of stuck with it and when you can't make anything like you don't know what you're doing with anything oh Nathan that's very kind mate well I'll tell you one thing if you weren't in I certainly wouldn't have any monster <laughs> Cultivating time, man. Right, uh, ah, okay, Dean, yeah. See you tomorrow, mate. Ah, I'll be back Friday, I mean. I think Emma said I could go on once tomorrow, like, because she wants to get ready and all that, if, if we were going to go out. Uh, obviously, at the time, we didn't know if we were or not, but I think we, I think we are... Big shout out to Tony for that. Uh, how many bottles of wine she drank trying to learn? None, mate. None. She doesn't drink at all, really, now. What website? Sparkle shoes off. Uh, ooh, good question. I, I actually don't know. I think I got them off eBay. Like, obviously from an eBay shop, but I think that's where I got them. I can't actually remember. Jason Carr. There's a name I've not seen for a while. How are you doing, buddy? Hope you're doing all right, mate. I really do. Nice to see old names in. I appreciate it. Hey, JD. How you doing, bud? Hope you're keeping well, mate. Eh, uh, no, they are full-on race shoes, mate, yeah. Like what you would get for, like, racing. Hey Kane, how's it going buddy? Oh, I'm absolutely spot on Jack, yeah, thanks for asking bud. Yeah, cannot complain mate, cannot complain. Right, can anyone explain to me what a subsoiler does? Because uh, I'm not actually 100% sure, but I do own one, and I'm thinking whether I should be using it or not. Uh, so if I go to this menu here, But I don't know when to use it. So do I still cultivate with that then? Ah, go on, we'll get it out, why not? I mean, simulate, you're very helpful there, mind. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I bet he's chuckling away to himself, though. Nathan, enjoy this, pal, and happy... Oh, man. Jesus, thank you, mate. 
Well, it'll go on the uh, steaks tomorrow, buddy, so thank you for that, much appreciated. I'll use it on uh, our taking Emma out, so much appreciated, man. Yes, mate. Well, obviously, made the farm from zero. The actual map is obviously uh, is obviously a, a proper map, but yes, the farm I made from nothing yet. It was just a flat field, and we have made it into a massive change, really. Alright, uh, right, okay, cheese dig. Free cheese for that, mate. Alright, I've started now using the editing tool, and man, that is a hard thing to do. Congrats for <laughs> Ruben. Uh, much appreciated. I mean, I am using a joystick, so I, I am struggling to be like precise with it. I, I can't get the mouse to work with it for some reason, but. The controls in this are just a mess at the moment, so it's not an issue, it's just, just is. <laughs> right, because uh, I love you, Sam. <laughs> uh, to be fair though, Ant always seems to have a spare cake to offer, so... <laughs> Who has like sacks of cakes ready to offer to people? Oh, well, I'm going to time you out for that comment. Everybody needs cake, man. Cake's like the most important meal of the day. Go on, Jack. Knock him. Oh, this thing's a monster, isn't it? I think we need bigger equipment, man. I think that's what we need. We're gonna, we'll do a few rounds the outside and then uh, need to find the next field to do. I think I could do with more grass, I think. So I'm tempted to buy a field and do more grass. <laughs> oh, JD, mate, you go for it. Proper feel, that's it. Well, I've got I've got my silage pit now, but I've got neat out to put in it, so we definitely need to do some more. One hundred percent, man. <laughs> I'm not getting involved in the argument because it normally involves me uh, offending somebody's wife, so. <laughs> That is nice though, isn't it? I'm loving my farm, man. I think it's mint. Absolutely loving it. And to be honest, there's there's loads of bits I don't like in it, like that are a bit rough. But because I built it from like nothing, it it kind of gives you that I don't know that sort of sense of achievement. I think. But yeah, we could definitely do with grass and some uh, some fields tonight. I'm not sure what to grass though. So, is there any fields that we own? Well, I'm not bothered if we own it, but is there anything cultivated? Or does everything need... Oh, Jesus. 
Right, so everything needs cultivating and... Right, so 11 I could seed and... Oh, so I could plough them and I could knock that two together. That would make a big field, man. I might do that, actually. So I'll buy that and buy that and we'll get a bigger seed of it. Yeah, big, big shout out to you lot though. I've also got Emma's presents to wrap tonight as well. I forgot. <laughs> well, to be fair, we only just went out and got paper for them, like, so. This is nice, this, man. Right, could you use this farm I have made for online? I don't know. Uh, I don't know if you can edit a farm online or not. I, I have not tried it before. I might, if I get time, what I might do at the end of this stream is chuck a multiplayer up for 10 minutes and just see if you can use the edit tool in it or not. Because I, I, I honestly don't know. Oh yeah, the big bud stuff was nice. Yeah, these are mods, but the the, the in-game mods, so the the free, uh, and it's in the mod hub yet. Right. So I need to hop off to the shop. Right, I'm gonna go and park this up. Oh, I may as well just take it to the shop anyway. We'll take it to the shop to pick our new gear up. Right, Nathan, if you open your farm sim, go to Mod Hub in the menu where you've got career multiplayer mod hub and go to the mod hub and just download the mods that are in there they're completely free and then you just activate them that's it that's all the, most of the mods that i'm using at the moment are no i'm not i'm not on the beta version now no this is a full release this so we need a decent sized seed because we've got a load of seeding to do so i want something decent so probably go down the amazon route i think because it's a good seeder like uh, this thing's good, but I don't fancy something with an air cart on it. It's just too big. Uh, so we'll go with that one, I think. It's either that or that. What about that? Nah, we'll go with that one, I think. Alright. I then need a decent sized tractor, but I don't want some stupid big like these i don't want these i just want and oh the fent 1000's big in it or go down the case we don't have a good case actually i've got john Deere's and i don't i'm not that bothered about a vulture i think i might go down the case route man yeah case it is Big bad boy case. Yeah. Right, I need to go put seed in it. So I think we need to go down the bottom of the map, I think. I cannot tell you how surprised I am that I do not miss my TVs one bit. And the funny thing is, I haven't sold them yet. So if I did miss them, I could just go and set them back up again. But <laughs> I just, oh, these, these monitors are just mint, man. 
Right, so I'm going to go down to the lime station, see if I can get some seed from there. I think you can actually, I, I, I have no idea to be honest. If I meet anything coming down here, it's going to be a nightmare. Hey Chris, how are you doing buddy? Welcome, welcome. <laughs> Sam, I was hoping nobody spotted that man. You know? Right, lime station straight on. Aha! So, when I came down here with my dad uh, in multiplayer, when you pulled up to the uh, hopper, you could change it to different things. So I'm kind of hoping we can stick seed in with it, but I don't think you can. Uh, I just, I'm purely just trying just for the sake of it. No, you can't. So, is there anywhere on the map where you can just put seed in, or do you have to put seed in through... Simulate, if you're listening, do you have to put seed in just by buying the pallets? Or can you actually do it anywhere else? If he is still listening, it would be really helpful, man. Because I am struggling a bit with like where to fill stuff up and that. Just pallets, right, okay. That's fine. I'm going to need to find a mod then that gets rid of the pallets, man. You don't think me and Dagoin should do a Johnny stream? Why? I can I can do realism. I can drive a tractor without picking my nose. I wish there was some way of not filling up with pallets, man. I've gone the wrong way, haven't I? Bollocks. Hang on. Where are those boys? I'm pleased I didn't go for a big tractor. I also found a nice mod on the mod hub. I haven't seen that on the mod hub. I definitely haven't seen that. Right, so I've got all the mod hub mods installed and I haven't seen any placeables. Have we got any? No, all right, so big bags. I need some of these, I think. And some of these bad boys. I thought you said the side tech thing was okay. Oh, I'll tell you what though, if you do ever sell one of the side panels, please hit me up first. I would love one, I really would. Oh, right. 
ei oo okay. kee What's that mod there then? Hang on. So that's in the model. Ah! What? Why isn't that in the actual model then? Is that for FS? Oh, that's for FS 17, that though. Wrong game, Chris. Right, we're full. Let's go see, man. Hey, it's okay, buddy. Oh, don't don't pick on him, man. It's not an issue. She's trying to help help us out. Right, so thirteen and eleven, and I need a plow a bit as well. So I don't know whether to take the plow up first or just start seeding. Probably just start seeding, and then we'll plow it another day or I could set the cedar away on a hired worker and then plow it I have seen some out there little legs yeah right we'll do a pass round first Right, we'll go around the once and then uh, up and down. Yeah, simulate. Would you ever sell a side panel, buddy? No, you just got to keep the pair of them. Right, did you want a link? Uh, I'm good mate, no, honestly I've seen a few, I'll, I'll find one if I need one, but I was kind of waiting until they just come a bit more mainstream at the moment, you know. Hi Ashton, how you doing buddy? No, I'm using mods from all over the place at the minute. I'm not using that many, mainly just from the mod hub, and I've got a couple of shed packs that aren't from the mod hub and a, a, a fence pack that isn't from the mod hub. Other than that, everything's just from the mod hub and it's just the landscaping tool. Ah, hang on. What's this mod then? Ah, lights! Oh, they're nice! Oh yeah, they're smart them. Oh, I'll, I'll have a look at them mate. Thank you buddy. Oh, that's nice of you Sam. It's nice that you're being nice because you think Kelly might be listening so you don't want to say anything bad. I appreciate that. I don't want you upsetting my girlfriend like. Alright, so we'll go and plough the middle of this. Ah, oh, I'll have a look. Simulate, yeah I'll have a look buddy. But yeah, let, let us know privately if you want to, uh, if you do want to sell one of your Satex side panels. We could even do a deal with the Thrustmaster TX if you're interested. Right, where the hell did I leave that plow? Oh, I left it over in the, uh, in the other yard, didn't I? <laughs> we can do a Y swap. It depends if yours comes with glasses or not. Uh, 
Uh, I don't actually need the cedar, we just need the plow. Right, uh, and the leather dress. Oh, I mean, if we're talking, if we're talking like leather or stockings, I'm in. I'm sold. Done. Right, uh, she's not listening. <laughs> I hope not, man. <laughs> you were just testing the water to see if she was in or not, weren't you? I did send you a private message saying it's for sale for 130 for the standard two pedals. You can get an adapter for the G29 pedals uh, to use in the USB if you want. But if you want to do a deal on a side tech side panel uh, and the TX, I could definitely do sort them out. I would definitely be interested in getting a side panel or so. Just let us know, anyway. Right, we're going to knock these two fields together and make a massive grass field, man. This thing's going to be huge. <laughs> very busy in the convoy tonight and very laggy. I lost. Yeah, me too. I did as well, to be honest. Some nights are mental, some nights are really quiet. It's just, you never know. I mean, obviously, server two, the problem is if you get any trolls in, they're always in cars, so... Yeah, it could be a bit of a nightmare. Uh, Sean, where would you mount the side panel? On the other rig. It doesn't have a button box on or anything at the moment, so I would put the side panel on the other rig, then I can farm with it, and it's got a button box then. So, yeah, that, that's kind of the plan. I'm just thinking, you know, with this being grass, there's probably no point in ploughing it, is there? I don't know if the ploughed grass is a bit better from a growth point of view. Fertilize seeded. Oh, you can't fertilize non seeded. Is that right? So, am I better to am I better to plow normal grass and then reseed it? Is that what you said? <laughs> we'll just crack on then. If if he says it's the way to do it, man, that's the way we'll do it. Yeah, well this is going to be purely for knocking out silage like so. 
Uh, I've got this massive field. I might even do 12 as well and just seed the lot. And then we've got a huge area then. I really enjoyed it actually, it's been a cracking night. It's been not bad at all. To be honest, I've had a really good time. And a uh, massive shout out to you all for tuning in and being fairly calm in the chat, to be honest. Oh, it has, it's been really nice, nice and calm, I, I, I can cope with that. <laughs> so, we're not running the biggest plough in the world, but it's purely because uh, I was just wanting to join these two fields together. I don't think I'm going to bother ploughing field 12, because there's just no point. Not long until Emma Mo she's in, yeah, she's already in, that's it. Right, uh, how are we doing? <laughs> I don't know what's going on. I was a bit lost, really thought. Uh, no, she doesn't start a new job until January, and then she got an offer from her old job to... What the hell's going on here? <laughs> Hang on. What are you doing? Jesus Christ, nearly chucked me out. Start you over here, I think. This is going to be a massive field. Does that possibly run out of fur that? I think it might have done, you know. I will see. Yeah, I mean, streaming a lot and talking to people a lot, it, it, you know, it can get you down a bit as well, to be honest. It, it can get, obviously, he's in a lot of pain with his back. Uh, he does have a severe back. Uh, problem I don't know what the best way to describe it because obviously it's unfixable uh, so it, it will only get worse uh, and he's really struggling with the pain so at the end of the day I'd rather him tell me and just take the time off he doesn't need to be on here every day at all One of the biggest things that he games a lot, but uh, obviously through the day he can get up and stand up, down, up, down all day. Well, you can't do that when you're on stream. He struggles to get in and out of the chair, so he, he's not going to want to do that while he's on camera and that, you know.
Right, so I've got that worker over there seeding the grass. If I can get this ploughed before I come off, I'll be happy, because then when we come back on, I can finish seeding over there. Carlos, good morning, mate. Uh, Simon. And, uh, yeah, as I say, we're going to be ending this in about uh, 10, 15 minutes. So, massive shout-out to Nathan and... Uh, Tony today, I really appreciate that and uh, I'll have a good day out tomorrow and I promise I'll get a photo of my steak and put it on the group. <laughs> right, although he does play the big part of I don't know what you mean there buddy uh... <laughs> yes, yeah, Sam. Yeah, little legs. I, I'm not sure what you mean. If my dad, if my dad came on tomorrow and said he's not coming on again, he, there's nothing I can do about it. No, his channel at the end of the day, it's, uh, he, he's here to enjoy himself with me. Uh, and if he's in too much pain and that, what's he meant to do, you know? I've always said the same and I've never hid the fact that he might not be on all the time. Uh, he's very lucky when he is on all the time, but... Uh, I know my dad's a massive comedy factor in the channel, he really is. He's a massive comedy factor in my life. Uh, but again, I can't expect him to tune in every day, stream seven days a week all the time, if he's not enjoying it and he's in too much pain, that's what he needs to do. So... And obviously if he does make a lot of mistakes, that can't be nice to do on live all the time. I mean, although everyone else finds it funny, it can't be nice mentally for him either. Because uh, certainly I know when I get it wrong, uh, you know, <laughs> of all the bad comments to write, oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, but yeah, as I say, I, I definitely feel it sometimes. <laughs> yeah, you're right there, Sam. You are right there. Hey, that's it, buddy. Hey, I'll be here for the next ten years or so. So, I'm sure we'll be. I'm sure we'll be back on in a couple of days. He might even be on tomorrow. You know, I, th I think in the message I got from him, I, as far as I'm concerned, he'll be on tomorrow evening. I think, but I'm not 100% sure. Right, I'm just Hey Richard, buddy, how are you doing, matey? Yeah, Nathan, yeah, that's it, buddy, and longer, you're right there, buddy. Right, so I need to seed this field as well. I'll bring the seeder back over, but as I say, I'll be ending in about five minutes or so. Uh, DB, I've had that a few times. Uh, you just got to uh, Alt Control, what is it? Control Alt Delete, and then do open the uh, the what's it called? Task Manager, and end the task. It'll be open in the background. You just can't get to it, and then just open it again. And normally it works for me, like.
Right, so alt, delete, uh, control, alt, delete, then ta yeah. Task manager, mate, yeah. With a T. Jimmy, uh, Jimmy, I am selling a Thrustmaster TX wheel, 458 Italia. Uh, they were about 230 quid, I think, new. 220, I think, ish. So yeah, I'm selling it. I'm, uh, really, it's a really nice wheel. It really is. I would certainly have another one if I didn't have my Fanatic stuff. Uh, you know, the, the only thing that isn't that nice about it is the the original rim that comes with it. But I do have a T300 rim that I can sell with the wheel, uh, which is a round rim, which is nice. And I've got some 3D printed adapters as well, so you can run a, a, a proper race wheel with it. Right, we better go and put the plough away because we're done. Excellent. And give it a quick wash and then that'll be us. I will, I will, Ed, I will. Th thanks for the kind comment there. Right, I was going to put this in the... Uh... Right, I need to put this in this shed here. Oh, no, we're using it. No, no, it doesn't matter. I need, I'm using it anyway. My bad, I forgot. Yes, Richard, it's... Uh... Basically, I'm going to knock three or four fields together uh, and I'm going to make a massive grass field. It'll be huge. I'll show you on the map before we disappear. So yeah, we're knocking uh, this field here. So uh, basically, I'm going to take 12 and 13 and 11 and knock them together. And then I've also got this field here, which I've knocked through to a grass field as well. So. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty big, like. Right, home we go. Set the gate to home, and then that's us done. A DB plays, mate. I, I, I don't know what you want me to do. If I do Control Alt Delete now, you'll see that I get this screen. Click on Task Manager, and I then get. Hang on, it'll take a sec. I then get this screen here. Now that's all the usage of my stuff. You can see my GPU's at 70%, CPU's at 43. This is all the gear that's running, uh, all the background processes, everything that's running on the computer now. And that happens whenever you press it, so. That happens on all computers, all operating systems. I'm happy with this area now though. This area now we put grass in it. It's looking way better. Oh, also Richard, we added in a silage pit which we didn't have. So we grassed this area here. So all this is now grass. And then we added in a pit for silage. So we'll put this in now. We pushed the cliff back in that as well. And then we added this uh, pit in here, so yeah, it looks all right, doesn't it? Fairly happy with it, man.
Right, I'll take the dog up the cliff and then uh, that's us done. Alright, doggo. Alright, dog, let's go up the cliff, man. I right, hope you have a good... Ah, oh, cheers, James. Yeah, I'm sure we will, mate. Yeah, I'm sure we will. Come on, doggo. Excellent. Right. Can we get the doggo a bit closer or not? There we are. Right, there you go. Looking over our awesome farmyard with a dog. Uh, I'll see you all probably Friday now. If 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 I get five minutes, I might do a bit of racing or a bit of trucking or something tomorrow. Uh, but we'll just, we'll just see how the day goes now, because I'm sure my wife will want to go and get a shower and that and get ready for the night time. So I'm pretty sure that'll be the case. Like, But we'll see. I might pop on for a couple of hours, but uh, if not, I'll let you know on Facebook if my dad's on. So massive thank you to you all. Uh, I appreciate you all probably a lot more than what you think. Uh, big thank you to you all for supporting us all day and uh, being in all the streams. I'll see you all on Friday and uh, thank you for all Emma's birthday wishes as well. See you all Friday, take care and have a good one.